we have now uh, here the GPS drone ZLRC SG907 GPS drone uh, it is here with its remote controller this is the drone itself I like the color of it it's a uh, like a dark silver color or gray color the camera is right here it has no gimbal stabilizer but it should be okay when uh, the weather is fine So now we'll try to fly this drone. So what you will do is to click on or tap on the lock icon. And the arrow and then slide it and there it goes. Now it's flying. It's flying. It's stable. Looks good. So it's actually flying and it seems to be just uh, fine holding its position like a GPS drone should be. I like the design of this drone, it looks good. It looks like it's uh, made well, uh, it looks like it's uh, durable and sturdy and even right now uh, it is flying uh, without having to calibrate it so we might have to calibrate it later on but it didn't ask for calibration so we decided to fly it it's a bit windy and you'll notice uh, uh, that it's uh, being moved a bit by the wind we'll try to pilot this drone we'll turn on the the power Turn the power here. Now it's on, and then we'll use the controller. Let's go and see how it goes. Three meters away. And what we'll do is we will click on the lock icon or tap the lock icon. Again, lock icon, arrow icon. Arrow, slide, and then it's up. So, try this first and see if it works. It doesn't work. It's up there. So, it's flying stably. Try it higher first, higher. Again, and we'll go forward. And we'll go forward. Go forward. A little bit farther, a little bit farther, see how it will come back. So we'll use uh, the return to home button or we'll try to press the return to home button. It goes up to the required height according to its configuration and then it will come back it will circle
Now it's going down. It landed, but uh, it's almost two meters away from the landing pad. So two meters away, but not bad. Still, it's still, it's close to home. 